What's going on guys? Welcome back to Goshen's Games. I must admit, I like this game probably way more than I should, but I mean, that's my problem, that's not your problem, but today we're going to talk about where the best place to farm those pesky books are. Now those books that I'm talking about, if you guys are unaware, you use those books in order to, not that, you use those books in order to activate your character's abilities and skills which is kind of being blocked a little bit by my camera but you can see it so if i click on this one for example i need six wind element books or sacred arts manuals in order to increase her incarnate level so these books they're pesky because you need them you need a lot of them in some cases you need like 10 16 15 whatever like this one right here you need 15 so we're going to take a look at the best place to farm this out. Now, big shout out to the guys in the SAO ARS Discord because we were actually talking about this for quite some time this morning trying to figure out which stage is the best. Now, going through it, there's two places that are a little bit better than others, but there's one that is the best place to do it. So we're just going to take a look at the best one, which is in 7-3. 7-3... And that's the second one. So 732 is the stage. Now, if we go over here to the information, we look at the rewards of this. Boom, right there. You can see you can get two books of any type. Now, it drops quite a few of them. And so what you want to do besides that, so we're just going to go ahead and just going to auto everything. Now, you want to pick your boost item. All right, so get your boost item confirmed because then it'll double the books that you get. So let's go ahead, start the quest. And I'm going to let it auto but i'm going to stop the auto right at the end before we kill the boss because i want to i want to show you guys the books so i can't show you guys if i leave it on auto because it'll skip that screen so i'm gonna let it go do its thing and then i'll go ahead and stop the auto in the meantime hope you guys are enjoying this make sure you hit the like button subscribe if you guys are new and all that stuff i hope you guys are having fun with the game if you're new to the channel consider joining my discord down below in the description also join me for my live streams and join me for my other games that i play as well because we play tons of games on the channel not just this uh i'm working on a schedule for you guys so just a little fyi i am working on a schedule to put out there for you for when i go live for everything it's just that's been a work in progress for a while now so uh, so just something to keep in mind now as far as a video schedule, I usually put out videos 9 a.m. E These are all Eastern times. I usually put out a video 9 a.m. around 2 or 3 p.m. And then about 5 p.m. Again, all Eastern times. And then I go live. So if I don't put out a video on that specific time or whatever, then oh, I just screwed this up. Okay, hold on, hold on. You'll, you'll see it really quick, but you'll see it. Because it's going to skip it. I, I didn't want it to skip it. Oh, there, there were the books. All, all, there, all those right there was the books. But you saw it. Like right here, you're not going to see it. It was in the screen before. But we're going to go ahead and we're going to challenge it again. Because I was in the middle of talking and then I completely forgot. But so if I usually, if I don't do a video on a specific time or whatever, it's because I'm going to go live. So, just a little FYI for you guys. So, if, like, for example, there's no video at, like, 5 p.m., that's probably because I'm going live that day. Um, us again, usually around 8 or 9 p.m. at night. I do go live in the morning, early afternoon, like, around 10 or 11 a.m. So, there's a lot of stuff that I do on the channel. So, I'm working on a proper schedule. So, what well, you guys know, okay, this is when we're going live. This is what we're playing, and, you know, that way you guys can join in, and it's no longer, oh, he's live, you know? You guys, you know what to expect at that point. Now, let me get rid of this auto, because that's going to, uh, it's going to screw me. Get, get rid of that auto, do it. All right, so now we got rid of the auto, so we can go ahead, and I can show you guys exactly what I'm talking about when it comes to the books. So we did our double item. So here we go. Yeah, yeah, finish, skip. Okay, so when we go to the next screen, you'll see. Boom, right there. Look at all those books. Look at all those books, guys. 
So I got four fire books. I got four. Is that earth? It, I have a hard time telling the earth from the um, from the light ones because they're very similar. Like one's yellow, one's orange. So we got two of each one of those. So basically you just run this over and over and over doing the same thing. And you'll be able to farm up a ton of books to be able to skill up uh, your characters very quickly. I mean, that's that's the biggest thing is those those skill ups or those upgrades in the characters are super important when it comes to doing damage and stuff like that. So look right here. Okay, so they were earth element because now I can actually skill up um, Alice here. So as you can see right there, took this thing takes 15 of the earth element books. That is a lot of books, guys. So it's a quick way to farm up. Make sure that you're, you, you are using the double item in order to do that. So now I got to go farm some more books because this one takes 10. This one takes 12. Also, keep in mind the, the double item thing, which right here, the, uh, the item boost. You can get these using friend points. Uh, you can get them from Ordinal Battle. Which I think I just passed it right there. You can get them from Ordinal Battle and you can get them from the events. So I already bought them all from the events. You get quite a few of them. You really do. I think I got like, it gives like 10 on each one. It's a lot. It's a lot, guys. So I already exchanged them all. Um, I don't... Actually, you can get them here too, I believe. Yes, you can. So you can use your memory cubes, which I don't... Don't do it. Don't use your memory cubes for them, guys. Definitely not recommended. Uh, use your other items from the events and stuff like that and the events re or the rewards refresh Okay, so event 23 days. So after 23 days, this will refresh 18 days We're gonna get a new event on Monday. So that'll probably have its own rewards as well So things like that like they give tons of rewards for running the events So that is the easiest way to farm the books out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video hit the like button subscribe if you guys are new I'll catch you all in the next video guys because I'm having way too much fun with this with this game. Peace out guys. Stay cool.